Hello friends, it's Jim O'Rear. Today, we are going to look at this hilarious and cool collectible. So if, if you are a fan of the old Kinner figures back from the late 70s, early 80s, the little, little bitty Kinner figures, which were nothing great at the time. I mean, they were very cool for kids because it's what we had. But when you look at them now, you go, really? But <laughs> uh, Diamond Select has released this new version of Indiana Jones based on the 1982 little Kenner figure, except now it's a foot tall. It's awesome. It's a foot tall. And it comes in the like the blister packaging and all that, like the, the old Kenner toys came in. So this is like a gigantic blast from my childhood. If you've not seen these, take a closer look. Here it is, the gigantic Indiana Jones figure from Diamond Select. And again, this is based on the 1982 Kenner toy that came out and, and the way that they, they made the little figures back then. He's got his little pouch and pistol. He's also got a little, little uh, whip down there. And um, this thing is huge. It's, it's huge. And the packaging is huge. Look at that. There's my hand. And that's how big the figure and the package is compared to my hand. It's, it's like a foot tall. And um, he's got seven points of articulation. Um, as you can tell, he's not, you know, super poseable or anything. But it's really just the retro uh, effect and the retro idea of the whole thing. Um, it's a Gentle Giant Limited um, piece. And it comes in this great uh, retro style resealable blister card um, with uh, this vintage style card back that has uh, photos on it of other things that are, are offered from uh, Diamond Select and, and Gentle Giant. And this this is just a fantastic, hilarious, retro piece of childhood, like expanded. There you go. That is a closer look at Diamond Select's gigantic Indiana Jones figure based on the old the old little Kenner figure and it's huge. I love it. I love it. It's not coming out of the packaging because that blister packaging just makes it for me as well. But the, the good thing about blister packaging, if you do want to take him out, it closes it back up again. So, so I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you have, click that like button to let the powers that be know that you like the video. And while you're at it, click on follow or subscribe and you'll be notified when I upload new videos. But thanks again for watching. And we'll see you next time.